Hello everyone. Today we are going to discuss about the another laboratory technique that is VFISH in short form, and it is known as fluorescence in situ hybridization. The fluorescence name itself suggests that some color color is imparted color is imparted in this technique. Color is imparted in this technique. So here in this technique, what we do, the fluorescence DNA, the fluorescence DNA or RNA probe binds to the specific gene sites of the interest on chromosome. And the fluorescence color represent a chromosome specific probe. That means each fluorescent color represents a chromosome specific probe. The individual fluor fluorescence give color to individual chromosome so each fluorescent color it represents a chromosome specific probe so what it is used for it is used for specific localization of the genes it is used for specific localization of genes and direct visualization of direct visualization of chromosomal abnormalities at the molecular level so there could be micro deletion, there could be translocation, and there could be the duplication. In the micro deletion, what happens? In the micro deletion, no fluorescence on the chromosome compared to fluorescent at the same locus on the second copy of that chromosome is present. And in translocation, what happens? In the translocation, fluorescent signal that corresponds to one chromosome is found in a different chromosome and in the duplication what happens a second copy of chromosome that results in trisomy or tetrasomy is observed so you can detect micro deletion translocation and duplication by use of fluorescent in situ hybridization thank you